Hey everybody and welcome back to the Mind Catchers channel. Today I'm going to show you guys the Makeup Company Graftobian. And this is their lip palette. This is their high definition color palette for the lips. Okay, so that was just a cover. This is what the packaging looks like. Very nice and sleek, nice and shiny and travel friendly. There is a huge mirror there. And as you can see, there are 18 shades of lipsticks. I've seen their concealer palettes. I think they have foundation palettes, things like that. A lot of people use them in their kits. Very nice quality. Uh, however, lip palettes always make me think, is it worth the money? Is it really worth it? So I said, if any company would have a nice lip palette, it should be Graftobian because all the other palettes, people give them such high praise about. So let's see if the lip palette is up to par. On the back of the palette, they have each shade name. So that's great. You can uh, refer to what you actually used. And I like the fact that they have a little uh, area here, a little indention where you can put a lip brush. I have my own little lip brush. I think this is from the company Nanshi. It's a little lip brush here. So I'm going to swatch these lippies on my lips. We're going to see what the pigmentation is like for all 18 shades. It's going to go by pretty fast. And um, at the end, I'm going to give you my thoughts on is it worth it? Okay, I want to make mention before we begin that the two first shades here are both lip glosses. Uh, the first one is Vanilla Spice Lip Gloss. And the second one is Cocoa Glaze Lip Gloss. Okay, so we're going to save those for last. We want to get into color. Alright, so the first color I'm going to be applying to my lips is Sandalwood. <laughs> swatches the first two rolls here are very very light of course I think they would better suit lighter skin tones the pigmentation was surprising to me that last roll was very delicious I really really like the last roll um, I think it's kind of like uh, you have to swirl that brush around there a little bit uh, inside of that uh, color a little bit and it's kind of like um, hope you guys understand it's kind of like a glaze I think 
over the top to kind of protect it and once that brush gets down into there that pigmentation really picks up so don't be fooled by one little stroke uh, the more you dig that brush in there you're gonna get more color but that last row really really surprised me I didn't think I thought everything was gonna be kind of sheer but that last row was very pigmented so I'm really really liking that and I believe the other rows were pigmented just not on my skin tone but you did see a little bit of pigmentation uh, with that top row as well as the second row uh, the, these two glosses here the first two colors are glosses they both show up basically as the same color on my skin tone that's why I didn't swatch them uh, so overall I think that it's worth the money especially if you are a makeup artist or someone aspiring to be a makeup artist freelance makeup artist I think that you would make a very good purchase with this palette so all you would need was a few lip pencils and in my opinion you got just about every color you would need it especially for like bridal looks and things like that you really would have just about every shade that you would need so uh, one thing I can say and I haven't really checked the website to see but I think if they could have individuals that you can purchase uh, like if you run down on one shade you could buy the shade that you need instead of buying the whole package again or the whole palette again that would be awesome I didn't check the website to see if they had a palette like that but if they do that would even be better so that um, because I think that well from my experience when you're doing like bridal makeup things like that you kind of run down on a certain shade it's um, certain shades that just are perfect for bridal parties and things like that uh, especially your nude shades so you will run down on those very quickly so if there was a way to purchase them individually and put them back in the palette I think that would be awesome but overall this palette is worth the money the pigmentation was there okay so I hope you guys enjoyed like I said before um, I see these different types of palettes and uh, people will review them but nobody ever swatches them so you really want to know what they look like on the lips not necessarily on the hand because on the hand and on the lips is two different things so hopefully you guys appreciate the video and I think I'm gonna do many more like this we want to see what it looks like on not just on the um, arm okay or on the hand so that's it that's Graftobian I will talk to you guys in the next video. Cyber kisses. Bye.